Hello, my name is Sherry Tangbergen, and I'm the author of the DVD, The Watercolor Gourmet Cooks for You. In this clip, you're going to learn how to paint sunsets. And to paint a sunset, I started out already by putting the landmass down here. The only thing I'd still like to do is pick up some of my uh, green, my Windsor green, and put some little grasses on my paper to give some three dimension to this work. And I do that by picking up some yellow ochre and some Windsor green and just put a few little grasses going on here. Now for the sky, I'm going to be using light shades of blue, yellow, orange, and I'm just going to very quickly paint the top part of my sky here. And I want to keep the colors pretty light. And I want to gradually bring in oranges, and this is permanent rose, one of my fav favorite colors. Some cadmium red, or a little bit different color here. Some cadmium orange and some cadmium yellow to make different colors in the sky. And you want to vary these. As you get lower to the ground level, you want to put in a really bright sun because that's where our sun is going to be setting. And then you want to start putting some colors around your sun to make it look like the sun is going down in the hills. So I'm going to go ahead and start filling this in more and more colors until I get a nice variety. And I kind of work over the whole surface at one time because as the paint dries, different colors blend into each other and I get a nice looking sunset going on. Now the favorite thing that I like to do when I get to the very end, and I've got the colors about where I want them, I want to put a few clouds in the sky. So I pick up a piece of paper towel and I start removing just a little bit of the color just to make for a variation in the clouds. And I want to make sure that down here I have a really bright yellow. And my, I lost a little bit of my yellow, so I'm going to make it a little bit yellower right down here to make it look like the sun is setting. And then this is a cool tool. This is called a uh, Magic Rub Peel-Off Eraser. And it's white. And to get it to look like the sun is setting, I take my eraser and I start erasing away after the paint is totally dry. You have to make sure your paint is totally dry. And then you have sunset. This is Sherry Tangbergen, and thank you for watching.